Hello everyone, I am Dancer, and this is Planet Zoo, um, we're gonna hop back into Blossom Zoo right now. We've got a lot of work to do, um, I do wanna finish up what we've been working on for two episodes now, which is the main entrance and the beaver habitat. Um, I also want to get ready to add a restaurant because that is coming into the game in the very near future, which I am so excited for. And, you know, if we have time um, and money and stuff, because you can see we're negative money right now, which is um, not the best, um, I would like to add an information dash... A gift shop here. I think that would be really cool. So we're gonna hopefully add that in as well. Oh my gosh, our beavers are about to mate. We gotta watch them. Although that's kind of creepy. Like, what? Oh, yay, it was successful. Yay. Okay, and one thing I don't do enough is spend time with the animals. So I think we're gonna do that this episode. Hey, here's a thousand dollars. That That'll help with some of the bills that we have. Um, we're very much not making money. And that is because of the loans that we took out. I knew it was going to be a mistake. Um, but apparently I did it anyway. I just, you know, things happen. And unfortunately, it put us in this situation where... Our finances are not great. You can see our loan interest right here. $2,500. And we're only halfway through the mo or through the year. And then our loan periodic repayment is $5,800. So I think what we're going to do is I'm just going to up this as much as possible. Let's just go like a million dollars. 10,000. That's as much as possible there. And again, like a million. 20,000 as much there. So we're looking at about two years of just kind of sitting and chilling. Uh, we won't be able to do much with what we've got going on now. Um, but yeah, we'll be making some exciting changes. Are we making money from the beavers? I feel like we may want to add in... Just for now, um, another bin right there. Kind of clips, um, but that's okay. Then at least we get a chance of making more money rather than it being in a non-accessible path. Um, and then we also do have this area, which I would like to finish up next episode. Um, or this episode, sorry. I don't know why I said next episode. And I would also like to figure out how to fix these screens. No idea what I'm doing wrong. So I'll be playing with that. Um, probably after the time lapse, I'll come back and know what to do. Um, but yeah, I'd also like to finish this area up. But I think we're going to hop into a little bit of uh, just a fast forward and hope that by year five we can actually start building again and uh yeah i mean let's hope right oh we're about to have a baby otter or beaver <gasps> oh wow it's like actually really big like that wow wow you're so little okay let's see your stats um Oh, you don't have enough deep water? Is it because you can't get to it? Is it too steep for you? Where are you? Where are you, baby? Okay. Yeah, you're right here. I don't know. Uh-oh. Well, we may have an issue. Um, I don't know how we're going to go about that. Oh, no. Spotted or a fine, that's not good. Call vet. Okay, we got that taken care of. Yeah, we're just gonna hop into a time lapse here. Um, we have another reward, which is great. Hopefully, we can keep getting some easy rewards for some extra cash. Hopefully, by year five, we will be able to um, do something 
make money. Um, but yeah, we'll we'll have into the little uh, time lapse skip thing now. Right. Um, so we're back. We have a few issues, um, which we're going to go ahead and address right now. Um, I think there are too many boa constrictors in there. So let's go ahead and um, get rid of these two since these two are the babies. Um, yep, that was it. Okay, sweet. So that caused or fixed that issue. Um, now let's go ahead and get rid of of the other um the brazilian pink knee is that what it's called or the i don't know but we're gonna get rid of these guys to make some more money and i think that's all that we can do right now looks like it yep um, so I think what we have to do because we have a beaver, which is not, <gasps> oh, that's not good. Um, okay. Yeah. We're definitely going to have to take out a loan again, which I do not want to do, but it's how it's going to have to be, I guess, for this episode. Um, and what we need to do then is get, well, first of all, let's, um, make a little path a staff path that comes back here that kind of connects these areas up because eventually we'll have that um, but right now we need to get um, facilities in if I can remember what I need to do we need where's oh utilities right here we need water treatment because I didn't realize that we didn't put this in. Um, so that is my bad, everyone. I do apologize for that. We need water temperature. Does this reach that? No, it does not. So we'll get another transformer in. Okay, and then we have $3,000 left to build with. Um, actually, no, we don't, because we also need to get a vet surgery. Um. I can never remember where anything is in here. Yeah. Um, so we have negative money again, which is great. Let's go ahead and unpause, and that water should start to get taken care of. Um, I think we had an animal die as well. Which is not good. Um, so we have that to address as well. I do apologize for that. Um, it's not, not the intention. Okay, let's go to animal trading. What we have. Uh, okay, let's see. We've got a beaver in here. Send to zoo. Send there. All right. Okay. Let's see. Disease animal, disease animal. It's been boxed for too long. We're low on cash. Um. Yeah, we'll go ahead and get that active disease discovered. There's a lot of diseases we need to um, research right away. Low welfare. You'll be fine as soon as you get into your home. Okay, we're at two thousand dollars. Let's see if we can fast forward and maybe get some money. Um, actually, our money's just going down. We're gonna have to take out another loan as well. Ooh, I hate doing that. Okay, we're just gonna pause. 
we're gonna have a new time lapse um one where we get things going right that surgery wait add it to the group place it there add path there we go okay we've got that now we have seventeen thousand dollars that should be enough to add to this habitat here add a restaurant here add that building here and finish this building let's hope um i think my top priorities are going to be making this area look nice nicer than they currently are um finish this area because i think guests donate based on uh, maybe I, may, I could be wrong um but i thought guests maybe do donated based on the looks of buildings and stuff so that would be cool um also i want to get this building in but we might scrap this building until next episode if we run out of money i do want to get this restaurant ready uh, because i think it'd be fun to have guests actually come up here and get another viewpoint for the beavers and then i think the path for this um underwater enclosure or underwater viewing area will come from over here somewhere we'll probably eventually build this path out here and then it will just be a shoot off there and kind of like go underwater or underground and maybe have some more um little reptiles um that's kind of the future plan right now but i could change it all um so yeah let's go ahead and let's hop into a time lapse and let's get some building done um, before I do so, I'm just going to change the daylight. Average animal welfare is way down. Let's see if we can take a look at that. Um, go to animals. No. Um, oh, we have two. Okay, I see what's happening. Let's... Um, I want to press play, but then also I know our money is going to, like, drop significantly because of those loans. So, yeah, we're just going to let it be. We'll uh, press play afterwards. Hopefully, then, we've done enough to keep the money around. Although, I don't know how much we'll actually realistically be adding in, in terms of donation points um i almost wonder if we, it's worth it to like add a temporary enclosure and get more people and get more money i think i'm gonna scrap that idea though i don't i don't want to do that because that that could just be bad so let's not do that let's um Focus on what we've got going on here, and, uh, yeah, we will, um, catch you guys after the time lapse, I guess. All right, everyone. Um, so this time lapse didn't go quite as planned. Um, we, well, this whole episode didn't go as planned. Um, we are not out of debt and we're just digging a bigger and bigger hole which hopefully we can figure out next episode um and now with the new dlc being out um stay tuned i think i'm actually gonna try to get another video out this week um for the series since i missed last week sorry about that um things just got a little crazy um, but yeah, you can see we are working on this restaurant here. Um, you'll see it goes through a lot of changes. Uh, I probably could have kept cut this out of the time lapse, but I wanted to keep it in um, just to kind of show you guys like what my process is like uh, when building these new areas. I I am not good at building buildings. Um, if you guys can't tell, like, I, I just never build buildings, um, but I'm really trying to push myself and 
learn and grow like that. Uh, so yeah, I decided here that I hated what I had, so we were starting over. We're going with this layout, um, and you can kind of see what I'm going for. So that's going to be like a little outdoor picnic area, patio area, and then we'll have the entrance of the, um, and the inside of the building here. Um, I couldn't decide how big I wanted that, but I'm glad we did leave it expanded because it gives more seating inside. Now, I'm not sure how restaurants work. Um, we'll probably be figuring that all out in the next episode. And um, we're also going to be doing some other things next episode, so just stay tuned. Um, lots of stuff planned, and I'm excited. And I um, I haven't taken a look at the new new pack yet, but I will be um, after this video is up and released. And yeah, I think um, we're, we got a lot of good stuff going, and I'm really excited. Uh, but yeah, we're going to keep this same theme throughout the beginning of this zoo here. Um, so we're just taking those front end buildings and pulling them all in. And yeah, I think this area looks really nice. And I'm, yeah, I'm excited to see what we can come up with here. Um, still have to figure out a little bit of the logistics of the building, but I am so far pretty pleased. I was able to use the barriers, um, so that was kind of fun. Haven't been able to use those much. Um, and yeah, we are actually going to be needing a um, name for this restaurant, so if you have any name suggestions, please let me know. Uh, not sure what animal we're going to put on the other side, but on um, the one side of the building, like the main one side of the building, we have the beavers. So if you could think of something fun with the beavers, that could be fun maybe. I don't know. Let me know. Um, we probably won't be adding that episode or that uh, name in the next episode though, because I'm gonna go to record the next episode right after um, this episode is released. So I want to give everyone enough time to you know view the episode and you know make the comments. Uh, but yeah, I'm really happy with how this area looks taking a different fence in, an in-game fence. I do really like this one, and I think it's like pretty practical for a restaurant to have that. Um, and yeah, I'm really curious to see how the restaurants are gonna work. It's gonna be um, pretty fun though. I wanted to add this like wall there. Um, took it from actually a local restaurant that we have in my um, the city that I live in. And yeah, so it's kind of like a long wall where you have to walk past and then back in just to kind of separate the area here. Um, I wanted to go with these doors because, you know, I like, I just, I prefer to have like actual doors in. Um, but I ended up going with this door we'll go back to that door ended up going back to that one um I just I like the idea of like actually having a door in a building not just it open especially if it's going to be like a restaurant we kind of want you know the door but maybe in the Europe pack there's actual better doors that might work better so we'll have to check that out and um hopefully we can get that um in and yeah, here we're just using a little trick to get these two, uh, these benches to go all the way along um, against the edge of the path there by just extending the path with grass, the natural path. And we're going to cover that, um, the area, those little like posts things up with foliage. Um, so it's going to be hidden. No one's going to be able to walk on it because of the barriers. Um, but it still gives guests access to those picnic tables, benches. 
And yeah, um, so then I decided since we have this connected up, we better make this safe for the guests using that same path that or that fence that we used earlier. Um, and I think it works pretty good. I do really like this um, fence. Might have to make a custom one because um, you can see that the the um, words are difficult right now, um, but you can see that the fence doesn't always line up to the path very like perfect. Um, so we might have to do a custom one so that we can get those edges better. Um, but I don't think that there are any pieces in the game right now that allow us to do that. Um, but you know, that's okay. Here I wanted to make a change to this area. Um, and I wanted to make it like a more intimate feeling um, when you actually are seeing the animals so that it's not just all open um, and kind of give the animals some privacy. So that's kind of what we're going with here after we can get this fence fixed because that was driving me crazy. Um, have it good enough here. I don't know. Let me know what you think. Um, and then I wanted to, yeah, put this here, um, those wooden so that it is like a break and we're gonna put some um, videos and pictures of the animal actually moving around and I think it's gonna look really cool um, and yeah but we'll get to that next episode I have a lot to do for the next episode um, but so stay tuned but um, yeah we're just adding another little seating area in here and we're gonna pick out the screen which will probably end up changing because the square doesn't work very well and if we're being honest if I'm making any custom videos we won't be doing any um, squares because that's very difficult um, but yeah that is uh, kind of what we've got going on here um, yeah, I'm excited for the next episode. Let me know what animal we should add in next because I think we're going to need to add another animal in um, if we want to stay afloat and get out of this debt that we are in, um, which is a bit unfortunate that we're in the debt, but it happens um, with every hard mode game, I guess, that there's some debts that need to be taken care of um, but yeah just going with this basic foliage here gonna add in those same bushes that we have in between the two fence for the beaver habitat uh, just to tie in some of this area and make it look nice we still have a lot to do in this beginning area but i think we're gonna leave it for a few episodes until we can get out of debt i think the best way to pull ourselves out of the debt is going to be adding in some um, animals so we'll we'll be working on that uh, next episode and in the future episodes to come um, but yeah I think that is gonna be it for this time lapse it looks like we, we don't have much time left um, but yeah I hope you guys are enjoying the series um, please do if you have any comments feedback concerns do let me know as this is a realistic zoo. All right, um, everyone. I'm going to go ahead and unpause. And unfortunately, I didn't get it, um, quite as much done as I was hoping to. Um, you can see this building is still unfinished as well as we didn't get this building done. And all that's left over here is adding the roof. Um, but I don't think that'll be that bad. Um, I do want to add a few vendors in just so we um, can have a constant flow of vendors rather than having a bunch of people um, you know sitting over here in the staff area and not serving guests I'm gonna go ahead and uh, fast forward a little bit and um, yeah so one thing I did do is I added this sign in which I think it looks pretty awesome um, and I centered it to this bench I think I'm gonna be changing it to like actual beaver things because that could be cool like we can get some videos of them swimming if we can even find them I actually don't even think the beavers are 
in the habitat right now. Oh, there is one. Where are you? Hey. Here's another one. I think. Yeah, there's two in here now. Not sure where they are, though. Um, but yeah, I think that'd be kind of fun to get some videos, you know, of them swimming and doing their thing. And yeah, I do want to check. Okay, you are able to get to the deep water now. That was weird before. Oh, there the other one is. Yeah. Yeah, so that is uh, pretty fun and cool. Um, you can see people are using this restaurant pretty well. I do like this a lot. Um, oh, wait. People just, like, completely walked through that wall. Um, oh, well. It is what it is. Um, they're walking through benches, apparently, but that's fine. It's whatever. We do need to add uh, garbages in there. I just see, uh, see that now. Um... Where are garbages? Here they are. Garbages. Classic bin. Put a garbage there. Garbage there. Garbage there. That should be enough. I hope. Yeah, that should be good. Um, but yeah. I think we are- oh, people are using this. So cool. And there they are. There's so many out there. Um, I can't wait to have more beavers in the beaver habitat. I think that'll be really fun. Um, and yeah, I think we're gonna go ahead and end the episode here though. Thank you all so much for hanging out. Um, I do really appreciate it. Unfortunately, um, progress is very slow this uh, series as you can see as uh, we're going negative again because of these two loans that we had to take out one again um, but yeah hopefully once we get a little bit further in the game we will be able to actually make money and uh, yeah I um uh, if you have any comments or feedback or anything like that, please do let me know. Um, we also have to name this restaurant, so if you have a name, please let me know. We'll put the name right here. And yeah, I'm just going to say hello um, for those extra conservation credits. And yeah, thank you guys all so much for hanging out. Um, yeah, we will catch you all in the next one. Bye!